Here with Coach after the win uh, again, Coach. Congratulations, another Thank you. another W. Always good to, to get one for sure. Uh, talk to me about the match and one of the things that uh, I'm, I'm thinking here post matches. You talked about earlier this week about adjustments and things that uh, the scout and it seemed like you know it, it has been the case, kind of feeling each other out in the first set mm -hmm. and uh, was really able to put it on in the second set. But talk to me about those first two sets particularly, I guess, first. Um, you know, McNeese and the 6-2 that they're running this year, um, they just have a lot of different weapons. They can spread the ball out. Um, they've got some good middles that can put the ball away. They've, they've been dealing with some injuries. Um, so it, it, their look, as far as a scout standpoint, has changed a little bit. And it was a little bit different today as well. Um, and it just takes a little bit of time to kind of figure out those differences. Um, and I think when we were clicking and, and we had, you know, I don't know, we were efficient on our side. You obviously you saw that in set two. And the other times we were giving away a little bit too many of uh, unforced errors and free points or, or stopping our own runs. Um, and that made it a little bit harder on ourselves than it needed to be. But, um, you know, proud of them that, you know, when it mattered, uh, once again, this team finds a way to win and, and put it away and get a W. So was that the difference from that third set, just yeah. our, our own errors that really yeah. caused it? Um, you know, I'm, we were still a little bit more higher in set four than I would have liked, um, but you don't have to be perfect. You just got to be able to, to make it happen when it matters most. Um, and I think from about, you know, 15 on in the fourth set, uh, the, the attitude kind of changed out there and uh, just uh, people were a little bit, you know, I don't know. Uh, they executed better in, in whatever their role happened to be from 15 on, and that's what you want to see, and that's going to win you matches. Yeah, I'm not sure if that, that 15 points, what, the one that stood out in that fourth set was uh, Daria had a big kill yeah. as a, like a momentum kind of mm -hmm. taking kill, and that's where he kind of took off. So it might have been around 15, but I feel like that was a big point in that fourth set. It was, um, and it was a couple moments like that, but I think what's important in, in the big picture is that you can't wait for the outcome of plays to – to be the deciding factor on if you change that attitude or not. And I think overall, uh, we did that on our own, but you're absolutely right, Daria, rotation one on the outside, which isn't necessarily her normal position, um, but it is in that uh, rotation. And she made a great swing and put it in the middle of the floor and bounced it. Uh, talk about a little bit about Courtney's play today. Uh, she had another exceptional match. She's been playing really well over the past uh, several weeks, too. Yeah, no, she's been really solid, uh, hitting at a really high rate. Um, and, and early in the match, we weren't really able to get the middles involved as much as we wanted to and what we thought because we thought that they could be pretty successful um, in this match. And it took a little while for us to, or at least it was sporadic on when we could get the ball to the net to be able to get them the ball. Um, but every time she touched it, she did something great with it and I'm really proud of her. Yeah. All right, coach, again, congratulations on the win. Uh, two more next week and we'll try to get those going too. All right, thank you.